Okay, it's kind of dark out. Sun's sort of coming up. You can see some pinks and oranges back there. Shards going to just get lighter throughout the day. I feel like I just grabbed the same exact lamp in different colors. Not too long ago. Probably what? Two days ago. Anyway, it's trash day. We're back on the grind. No days off. Not really, but figuratively speaking, we're back out here. Trash day. Enjoying the end of the week. Hoping to find some cool things out here in the garbage. Let's pull them together and uh, make it a fun adventure. Let's do it. All right, life would be a lot easier if this car wasn't parked here, but I don't think this is one of the heavy ones. heavy ones, one of the lighter ones. Ryaways, I'd say like 80 pounds or so around there. Not one of those ones that weigh probably like 200. Interesting how this is on top. I don't know if it's missing something there. The lighting is getting better, but it's not the best yet. But look, that thing looks old. I don't know how old. A lot of paperwork in there. Receipts and stuff. Tax season, it's, a, it's kind of begun. I know you got a lot of things for TurboTax. People ask me how I do my taxes. I do them. They take a while, but I do them. Yeah, the longest part of tax season is definitely the receipt part. I don't think, uh, the nice thing about TurboTax, once you've done it once, it kind of saves all your information. It's just, you gotta put the numbers in. It's not necessarily like filing and, and filling out stuff, I should say. Not, I mean, filing, obviously, but it's not essentially uh, filing stuff. It's just putting in numbers. So you have to get those numbers. That's the, that's the long part. Let's be gone. Time of the year. Look at that sunrise. Better in person than on camera, but still nice nonetheless. Can't tell if this is metal or glass. No, it's metal. Really need to wash the van. Can't run through a car wash. It's too tall. You have to do the self one, which really doesn't clean your vehicle. It just sprays water everywhere and soap if you want. Okay. Hopefully, no one steals my van because I'm leaving it running right here and wishing for the best. <clears throat> Walk around this corner here. It's also raining. Road work ahead, that's great. Road work ahead. What? I thought this was an antique and I thought they were cleaning out this building right here. It looks like it's not. It looks like it's the apartment or whatever that was. Let me turn around and show you. There was an apartment right there. I thought they were cleaning out this, and from the road, this looked like it was an old one.
kind of looks kind of funky. Like with that thing. Oh, jeez. Looks kind of funky with that like that. Different. I might try selling it. It's got to be new. It's amazing. I used to go through this period of time where at auctions and even in the trash, I'd find a lot of antique, like 20s and 30s lamps. I just don't see them like I used to. All right, we'll walk over here first. I think there's stuff up there on the right. Sorry if the camera seems a little shaky today. I don't know what the is. loading up stuff from a funeral home parking lot, but hey, what the heck. I don't think this is metal. No, it's not actually. Took that. Press board with metal trim. Apologize if some of these clips are shaking. The sun, as you guys know, was right over there not too long ago, and now it's just kind of gone. It's just the clouds kind of took over. I'm looking up, it doesn't even look like it's that cloudy, unless it's one of those days where it's so cloudy you don't see clouds. As the common says, the math doesn't math, but that's how it works apparently. Sort of interesting because I don't know what it is. I thought it was something different, even though it might be what I thought it was. It's not what I thought it was, and it's not what it, it's not at all what I thought it was. I thought it was a, a knee scooter. Like if you injure yourself, your knee or your ankle or something, you're shaman. But uh, apparently it's an exercise machine because it says something about use caution while operating this exercise machine. So I feel like if it was a knee scooter, they wouldn't call it an exercise machine at all. Because it's like the complete opposite. Like. If you're injured, you probably won't exercise. Or they probably won't want you exercising. The bottom tire looks like it's in good shape.
<laughs> the top tire is the same. Looks like the same brand as my old tires on the van. There they are. Are they the same? Yeah. Tires that play, they have good tread in them. I'm starting to think. So that guy throws away, he throws away four tires. Well, at least I haven't come to this town in quite some time, actually. But he throws away four tires every single week. My theory here is he works for someone who does tire replacements or whatever. And uh, rather than them paying to get them taken away, they might throw him a couple bucks and he disposes of them. He just throws in the trash. That's my theory. Or he, maybe he works on tires, works on cars. He's doing someone a favor. I don't know. It's always great to make theories on everything. It's like storage units. Everyone likes them to make an assumption on what happened to the previous owner. I've noticed that from reading the comments. Speaking of storage units, stay tuned for tomorrow. Storage unit unboxing. Another video, another storage unit. It'll be fun. This looks like it was hidden. I tried hiding it, sort of, not really, but I can say it was hidden. It looks vintage. I think it's a sewing machine. If I remember to look at it, it's probably gonna be a next clip because I don't know how much more town I have left. But I'll show you guys what the sewing machine is. Oh, it says it's a Sears brand. I lied. I have one more street to go down. That's the rest of the street. It smells like barbecue ribs. That is a very interesting. Does this thing work? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that was really stupid. I put my hand right in there as it was spinning. Looks like it doesn't shut off. I kind of hurt a little too. Yeah. Don't put your hand inside a vacuum cleaner that has those spinning brushes. That was not smart. Okay, so. We made it back. Uh, not really made it back, but I'm here at Red Robins. They're not open. Uh, today has been concluded. It's another trash picking episode in the books. Add to the playlist of over 715 episodes, I believe, of uh, trash picking. Uh, we found metal. So it's been a very long time since I went to this town. I know with uh, all daylight savings and all that, uh, the days got really short here in winter. And I was just like, there's no way I'm going to be able to do trash picking at 8.30 in the morning when all the garbage companies probably already ran around probably two hours before. So the days are getting longer. I can feel it every single morning. You guys probably can feel it uh, going to bed or you know waking up, whatever it is, the daylight. The days are getting longer. There's more light in the day. Uh, other than that though, we did find some metal. Uh, I did say I'd go through to this. This is probably my best find. I think it's older. It doesn't have a barcode or anything. I think there's supposed to be a latch here. Or nope, never mind. Just goes like that. It does look older. I don't know how old, maybe 50s or 40s. Knowing my luck, it's probably a reproduction. Um, so let's jump into this guy. Let's see what this so it says Sears. I know the last time I think I found a uh, sewing machine in the trash, I didn't show it, even though I said I was going to show it. And I had a couple people comment that they wanted to see it. There we go, just like that. Would you look at that beauty? Wow. That thing probably cost a lot of money back in its day. This is all your, or that's your foot pedal. I thought that was all your attachments. Maybe the attachments might be underneath this if you unclip it. That might be my guess. I don't see any other compartments. Yeah, it's a beauty. It's not the avocado green, but it's a beauty. This thing was kind of neat too, but I think they threw it out because they can't get it to turn off. Because that's what it seemed like when I pressed it the one time. It seemed like that just kept going. I mean, I just clicked the on button. I just like clicked the trigger on it and then just kept going. So, 
I don't know. Uh, other than that, it's been a fun day. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this treasure hunt. Thanks for coming along. Stay tuned for tomorrow's storage unit video. Although that was filmed last week and it was filmed essentially the same day of my second video I post on Monday. Uh, I am posting it tomorrow. Uh, if you guys didn't check out those storage unit videos, I know the Saturday video did very well. The Monday video kind of did all right, but uh, it seemed like a bunch of people didn't watch it. Now, I don't know if it didn't appear on your feed or whatever, but if you want to check it out, it was posted on Monday. It's on my channel, and stay tuned for the next unit clean out tomorrow. But thanks again. Thanks for coming along. Uh, if you guys enjoy this kind of stuff, hit the like button and subscribe down below. I'll be posting more trash pick adventures through all of February and throughout the rest of the year. And of course, I'll catch you guys next time, next venture. Until next time, have a great day. Keep living a dream. Peace.